Government may be open again temporarily, but some of the issues the shutdown caused will linger. Our Jesse Inman is here to talk about a booming Springfield industry that is trying to make up for lost time. Jesse. Yeah, Heather, the beer brewing industry in Springfield has suffered a bit of a setback over the past month with getting new products approved and a brewery I spoke to will spend the next three weeks trying to catch up. At Mother's Brewing, the biggest impact of this shutdown is something they never want to hear. No new beers. We caught up with owner and founder of Mother's Brewery, Jeff Schrag, at the Springfield Area Chamber of Commerce Centennial Celebration tonight. In order to get new beers, they have to be approved by the Alcohol and Tobacco Tax Trade Bureau. They've been shut down now 30 some days. And probably everybody was like us. We were like, holy smokes, let's get everything submitted that we possibly can in case this continues. So they're going to have a huge backlog of things. And we don't know how long it will take them to get back to their old schedule, but I personally think maybe a year. Back at the brewery, operations chief Stuart Murr says this brought some of their releases to a screeching halt. We had a couple beers that were supposed to be coming out in February. Uh, we had submitted the labels for approval with the TTB in plenty of time under normal circumstances. Um, they were in process uh, and then when the government shut down, that stopped. That left about 150 barrels waiting for approval, which equates to about 8,266 six packs. That puts a big strain on finances for the company. We had planned on a certain amount of income, a certain amount of revenue coming in in February, and now that's not going to happen. Another 30 days or a 30 day shutdown at the end of three weeks is really going to crimp us in terms of bringing out new beers. Cash flow gets to be a real serious issue. Can we pay our employees? Can we do everything we need to do? Can we keep the lights on for that all that month? Um, and so, yeah, it affects a lot of things. Now, Shrog says that hopefully what this means is they just get February's revenue just simply in a different month, saying that that money won't go away, and their goal is to not delay any paychecks for their staff. All right, Jesse Inman tonight, thank you.